This is a very special bus. Most people would think that this would be a late 60s bus, I have a and it's car. not. It gets even weirder. What's going on back here? It's a mutant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a very special bus. Most people would think that this would be a late 60s bus, I have a and it's not. It's from 1992. I bet you didn't even know they were making buses still in 92. In Brazil, they were. This is one of them. It's called uh, Fleet Line, and it has a lot of strange and un unusual features. First of all, this, there's no split window here. You know, like this one, nice split down the center. This is the new improved. This started in 68 throughout the world. The front bumper, it's a weird mutant bumper. I think it's Brazil only. So the front is basically a 1968 Volkswagen bus with the exception of this cool, funky little emblem that they put on it. And they also embossed in the steel. But as you start to look around it, there's, there's a lot of things that kind of don't make sense to a regular Western or European Volkswagen maker. Um, this is a mishmash of parts and uh, different stampings and pressings that were only done in Brazil, but they were still shipped out around the world. Um, some of the weird features are the rain gutters are super thick. There's a lot of strength in this. If you look at the earlier style, it's a small, thin lip. This one is a lot stronger. In, in other countries, they carry a lot of weight on the roof. You always see pictures of whole families and, you know, like cows and grandma up on the roof. Well, that's why they did that. They strengthened up the roof. The, the brakes, this is the new smaller five bolt pattern. So this started in 71 with power assist disc brakes. Why are you so tall? Get down, get down. You see that? Look at how small that is on the, on the, on, and the other one, it's a 120 millimeter, and the other one is a 205 millimeter. This thing, I don't know what that is. That's homemade. We, we, you know, that thing's. But so now we have the same window pattern as the earlier bus down the side. Everyone's familiar with the window pattern with, you know, little kids' heads or beauty contestants or something. But what we notice is that there's a, there's a little extra space right up here which makes the windows just a little bit shorter than the later ones. So this whole section up on top is really weird. These windows are, are shorter and the, look at the pop out window has no frame because they all rotted out. Look at, they, they all rotted out, so they're like, hey, let's get rid of the frame, and we'll put the gasket in, like normal manufacturers, and it seals right up. Huh, look at that, that's cool. Brazilian, Brazilian only. Now we look at the vents. The vents, these are the same ones that they've been using since 1950. They're just inside out and upside down. If you look at these ones, these are any, any ones that are common through the 60s, uh, 63, when did they go to any event? 63? 62 to 63. I'm not an expert. The, uh, the corner windows, they ended in 63. Now you gotta think, this is a 92 with corner windows. But they're just a little bit short because they're Brazilian only. They're actually a little bit shorter. Now, the upper part is 63 and earlier. But when we get down here, this is what? 74 started this. 73. 73. 
now they had to press that in there, which is really weird. You have, if you if you saw this corner and this corner, they don't they don't look the same. The other one's all square. It gets even weirder. What's going on back here? Look at this. This deck lid is the same that they used in the U.S. markets. No brake light, but flat in 57, 58. I think it's 57, 58. But it has a late push button door handle and some weird hinges because the hinges always broke. So they changed it to this post in 79 handle. What about the, what about this? This is only to 63 because it goes with the corner and it's for a deluxe bus. It has a bigger window and this sliver, when was the sliver used? 62, 60, 62. So the 62 deluxe. 58, 74, 63. Weird ga gas door, you know, no gas door. That's weird, I don't know. So, it's pretty weird. But, you know what's cool? If you're traveling in Mexico, you can pick up a brand new fuel injected late beetle this is a out of a, probably out of a 90s or early 2000 uh mexican beetle so we have a love -ish, love we have a love fest here we have the boys in brazil making the bus ladies and gentlemen in mexico assembly the engine of a german design and now some guy is going to drive it across numerous continents yikes i, I, don't, I don't know about that but it's pretty interesting. So one of the coolest features about this bus is the doors. Now, you've all seen there's two different types of doors. Well, with the big window, you should have had a sliding door here, which remember what, it would always get stuck, <laughs> slide the door back. Well, on the earlier buses, they had the clamshell opening doors. Well, these doors, <laughs> probably, they, these doors are from the earliest generation bus uh, the barn door, and these are actually 55 and earlier doors. They're not exactly like the German doors, but the whole structure, design, everything is from 55 and earlier buses. So you have a 68 bus with 55 doors and a 71 suspension, brakes, uh, a Mexican fuel injected motor with a 58 deck lid. 63 corner windows, 62 hatch, weird frameless pop-outs. It's a mutant. 74 taillights. Oh, look, you got solar, too. Dude, this thing, look at, oh, look at this. Oh, I forgot. How is this strengthening ribs inside here, right? Because Volkswagen Brazil knew that they were using their, their, butt, their people were using them hard, right? On, country dirt roads with lots of gear and so they actually added a lot of stiffening braces throughout the bus where they knew where was the weak points they actually smoothed out some of the corners and added gussets and thickened some some stuff up and you know to so it would hold together but and hopefully it stays together for alaska <laughs> we'll see about It's hard to get you and me in shot at the same time, Thanks for watching this video and for checking out the little tour of our 92 Brazilian V-Dub bus. If you want to check out 10 Foot Doug's bus, and you really should because it's an absolutely beautiful 23 window barn door classic, click the box below. Until next time, happy travels.